We're in the basement of the Quinlivan residence looking at a possible full system replacement. Uh, we did, the customer did have a quote from our plumbing department for a water heater. Uh, gonna take a look at the outside. If it's a five ton, we're gonna need some extra space and, and either move this water heat over here. So I'll call plumbing and talk to them if, if they want us to do that so that we can uh, move that at the same time. Uh, return drop, uh, we'll replace that coming down, get our media cabinet in. Uh, again, if it's a five ton, we'll need to get a geo filter cabinet and do a wrap around on this side. It's a two story home, but around 2000 square feet upstairs. Uh, so we may need some extra space. I uh, put that wrap around our line set travels about 25 feet wall rack unit up there on the side if we go back with a high efficiency furnace uh, we'll take a look at there's a deck on this side of the home but then over by our AC unit uh, we can take it out that way if, if need be if we choose to go high efficiency route rework our copper gas lines coming back in new unions disconnects and shutoffs same with water heater if we're doing it. Reroute our, our water lines over to drop up here against the wall if it's a five ton system. Redo our electrical coming down from the ceiling. Everything looks to be in good shape. A uh, new drain line about two feet off the front of the furnace. <coughs> Replace our five, four, th five by four by four T on our flue. Two-way split trunk line, it's in good shape. Uh, customer said doesn't have any comfort issues with the existing system. Uh, existing height on our furnace, 47 and a quarter, so we've got plenty of space, even if we have to go with a, a really tall coil uh, to get it built and, and transition back with a base on it. Any questions, let me know. Outside of the Quinn Living Residence, looking at a full system replacement. Linux AC system from 99, original of the home. We got it on a wall rack here. Cut that off, um, mount the, in the foundation about the same height, get a little bit lower for servicing. No electrical disconnect and whip, uh, depending on what setup we go with. Uh, it's a 7 8 inch line set. Most likely we'll be flushing and pressure testing, but if not, we'll need like three or four feet of uh, insulation and thermoplex as well. Access parking out front here on the right side of the home as far as equipment for the basement we can come back down there uh, our inside the closet is right here on the other side so our furnace sets uh, maybe 15 feet right in there um, this space can't do with with where that deck is uh, but we could easily route those line those uh, exhaust lines for the PVC to this part or even on this side. Thinking about possibly moving this thermostat here, our existing thermostat sitting on the wall, uh, kind of near the front door, but our biggest concern when it's the middle of the summer, our four o'clock, five o'clock sun shines right through that window directly on the thermostat, causing it to run nonstop. So, altering that location over to this side. Our basement access, it is drop ceiling. Um, thinking it might be easy to run, new electrical. This over and up. Or do an ERM board or excuse me, an EIM 